All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. That's the Father in the name of the Son. And double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. And it's a sincere Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and sincerity. Um, the title of this video is probably going to be called uh, The Meek Shall Inherit the Earth. And now, uh, start off with the verse. Psalms 37 and 11. It says, But the meek shall inherit the earth and shall delight themselves in the abundance of peace. You know, the reason why I entitled, well, titled this video, The Meek Shall Inherit the Earth, is because you have a lot of guys who come into this thing, you know, or try to come into this thing, and they think it's all about um, putting Esau to death and uh, killing the two-thirds, you know, when they are acting as though, like, they already know that they're men of the Lord, you know, or that they got everything right, you know, so... The main thing is that, like, you have to be humble, you know. Esau is going to get this, you know. Rightfully so, you know. But that's not what it's all about. We out here trying to bring honor and glory, you know, doing the work for our Heavenly Father, you know, our Creator. And trying to get people to come to Him, you know, with long-suffering, patience, you know. Hey, some people ain't going to get it, you know. And the scriptures, you know, let you know what you're supposed to do, you know. But the main thing is, like, we shouldn't get caught up on the wrong things, you know. And one of the main things that, like I said, you got people who think that they're already of the elect, you know. And then they're not being humble about it, you know, in general. So this is, you know just to go out to for brothers to be more humble when they're doing this you know um this is uh second peter one and uh i'm gonna start at the third verse it says it, or Shalaki, I'm going to start at the second one. It says, Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of the Most High and of Yahweh Shai, our Lord, according as his divine power have given us unto, have given unto all, I mean, us all things that pertain unto life and godliness through the knowledge of him that have called us to glory and virtue. You know, like, being a king, if you want to put everybody, you got you to gotta rule over somebody in, if, in order to be a king, you know. And if you're putting, like, everybody to death, like, what type of godliness is that, you know? Like, you, like brothers need to be more wise when you're dealing with this this, this truth, you know, because it's all for y'all by some y'all side. And it's like, y'all by some y'all side is going to give the order for, 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 for the brothers to, to go out here and destroy them, you know, and rightfully so, you know, I want to be a part of that, you know, whatever the Lord says to do, you know, I'm going to do it, and I'm going to enjoy doing it, you know, of course, I hate everybody who doesn't want to do what the, the, the Lord does, you know, but it's more, fo I'm more focused on myself, you know, to, to, to make sure that I get, you know, where I got to be at, but I'm also trying to help the, the, the Akim, you know, the brethren to be more, you know, brotherly, you know, because that's one thing, too, you know, here you got people worried about putting Esau to death, but you're not even worried about, you're not even trying to be a brother, you know, helping your brother out, who probably could be struggling, you know, what more, what means more, you know, of course, Esau, if, if you, if you take everything back, that Esau is the problem, you know, but you can also help your brother out, you know, and brothers just want to be focused on, putting two-thirds to death, you know, when, when y'all, the, the, the reason why a lot of these people are mad at the so-called two-thirds, 
ain't even based off the scriptures. You know? Y'all, y'all, y'all got personal vendettas with people, you know? In some some in some in some cases, you know. Cause rightfully so, the two a two third ain't gonna get it, you know. They 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 need to be destroyed, you know. And we put cur I put curses up on them all the time, you know. But um Salaki, I'm gonna continue. It says through the knowledge of him that have called us to glory and virtue, whereby are given unto us exceeding great and precious promises, you know. Like in order to receive these great and precious promises, you have to be humble, you know, in order to even receive that, you know, because we we're not worthy of none of this, you know, and then uh, they, we went, we we got called, but that don't mean that we're of the elect, you know. It says that by these ye might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption. That is in the world through lust, you know, that, 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 that one of that lust, you know, is, is people wanting to be carnal, you know, and, and, and with that, you bring in the pride, you know, and, 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 and what, what this type of video, a lot of people wouldn't even be able to, 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 to get it, you know, it says, and besides this, given all diligence, you know, cause you're supposed to be diligent in this thing, you know. So one of the, this this video goes out to them I I U I C clowns also. They say add to your faith virtue, and to virtue knowledge, and to knowledge temperance, and to temperance patience, and to patience godliness, and to godliness brotherly kind kindness, and to brotherly kindness charity. For if these things be in you and abound. They make you that ye shall neither be burned nor unfruitful in the knowledge of your, our Lord, Yahweh Shah. But he that lacketh these things is blind and cannot see afar off and have forgotten that he was purged from his old sins. Wherefore, the, the rather, brethren, give diligence to make your calling and election sore. For if ye do these things, ye shall never fail. You know, so that's one of the main things, you know, we, 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 we got to make sure that our calling is sore, you know, doing everything for the Lord, for every, everything for y'all by some y'all side, putting him first, you know, bringing glory to his name, not us, you know, because he could, he could, he could have somebody else put Esau to death, you know, and you, and you not even be a part of that. So you gotta you gotta be you gotta focus on the right things. You know the the main thing is your how about some you You know. Um this is Matthew and I'm gonna try to make this as short and uh sweet as possible. Matthew twenty three And 11, it says, but he that is greatest among you shall be a servant. And whosoever shall exalt himself shall be abased. And he that shall humble himself shall be exalted. You know, like we aren't worthy of salvation. You know, at the end of the day, we're all equivalent to being pieces of shit, you know. So it's like, we got to remember where we came from, you know? Our past was totally messed up, you know? The Lord could call out a two-third out of anything, any, anything. You got murderers. He called, he called uh, Paul out of, uh, out of being a murderer, you know? Just an example. You know, the Lord can call anybody up out of it. But you got to be patient, you know? You can't be carnal. You know, if they don't get it, hey, that's on them. That the, the nuclear destruction, the Lord going, the Lord going to get them. You know, and that's 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 uh, 
that's that's important, you know, because we we out here to bring glory to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah, you know. Um, Second Peter three and seventeen. Ye therefore, beloved, seeing ye know these things before, beware lest ye also, being led away with the error of the wicked, fall from your own steadfastness. You know. So so. You have to be be in the right mind, you know? You got to be balanced with it, basically, you know? The scriptures say it's a time to kill and a time to heal, you know? You got to you gotta be balanced with it, you know? Brothers just want to curse out the so-called white man, you know, all the time. And, 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 and they do need to be cursed out, don't get me wrong. But the, 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 the other thing, you got brothers, you know, that need to be edified. You know, that's that's the main thing. And 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 like I said, brothers acting like they're already a part of the elect, and we don't know what 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 what's gonna happen during that day of the Lord. You know. Um. Isaiah sixty four and. Uh, six. It say, but we are all as an unclean thing, and all our righteousness are as filthy rags, and we all do fade as a leaf, and our iniquities, like the wind, have taken us away. You know, so that's that's clear and, and straight to the point. You know what I'm saying? Like we're nothing. You know, we we hoping. And praying that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh shows mercy on us. You know? That's who it's really for. You know? But I'm going to um, get, get uh, two more scriptures. Um, Revelation 3 and 10. It says, Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, you know? So we got to be patient, you know, that's one of the things, you know, and first Peter is that, that it, it said, you know, be patient, you know, but Yahweh Shah, you know, first and foremost is saying be patient, you know, and and what the scriptures say, you know, here's the patience of the saints, you know, it says, uh, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the word, world. To try them that dwell upon the earth. Behold, I come quickly. Hold that fast which thou hast, that no man may take your crown. You know? So with with the with the, 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 the brothers who, you know, got the mindset that they are already uh, a part of the elect or you know, however brothers want to look at it, you know. It's you you, you, you gotta be in the right mind, you know. Because the them, them blessings that, that are going to come from the Lord, they're going to be exceedingly great, you know. But can you imagine the, the, the mindset that you have to be in in order to, to, to get that, you know, to be humble, you know. Um, can you imagine the feeling that it would be to, to, to be a king, you know. Can you imagine the women being in order, the peace, you know, the happiness being the head and not the tail? You know, can you imagine all of these this, this beautiful, beautiful blessings that Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai is going to give to the ones who are patient and wait on Him? You know, can you imagine that? The feeling like just imagine being a king like that. Like I'm really, I just really made it. You know. Okay, salvation is one thing, but that don't mean anything that you're going to make it to see the kingdom, you know? So, like, imagine the, the, the mindset you got to be in, you know? And that's one, of the, that's one of the reasons why I chose this scripture, you know? Because um, Yahweh Shah is the greatest example, and Yahweh Shah was also King Solomon, you know? Um, it's uh, 1 Kings 3 and... 